As we mentioned, 4th of July weekend might look different this year, but socially distant barbecues and a lack of fireworks displays aren't keeping folks from celebrating. Our Dylan Soraki checked out an Independence Day event in Cherry Valley with a twist. Cherry Valley leaders wanted to continue the village's annual 4th of July celebration while making sure that people stay safe during the COVID-19 pandemic. Rather than having people gather together for a parade, they brought the parade to the people. Every year we have a parade through the village of Cherry Valley, which we start here at Village Hall and we go down to Bowman Park. And we normally have a lot of kids in the parade, the streets lined with a lot of people. Cherry Valley Village President Jim Clayson says normal parade festivities weren't possible this year because of COVID-19 and recommendations of social distancing. We still wanted to celebrate the 4th of July, so we came up with the idea of doing a reverse parade where we're getting a number of vehicles lined up and we're going to go through every single neighborhood in the village of Cherry Valley. Fire trucks, motorcycles, and classic cars decked out in red, white, and blue were all part of the caravan. And Lady Liberty was on hand to wave to spectators. Parading down residential streets gave people a chance to celebrate Independence Day from the safety of their own driveway. People are at home, social distancing, and we just want to let them know that it is the 4th of July. It cannot be forgotten. This is the land of the home of the free and the brave, and we got to keep celebrating. Clayson says even though traditional celebrations might have to be put on hold this year, it's important to recognize America's independence in one way, shape, or form. We're not forgetting it here in the village. We're celebrating. I know we can't have fireworks. I know we can't have the tra traditional parade, but we're going to have this reverse parade and wish everyone a happy 4th of July. Normally, kids can look forward to candy or treats being tossed from parade vehicles, but that wasn't the case this year as an extra safety precaution. In Cherry Valley, for your home team, I'm Dylan Siraki.